Hi guys, it's Amit from Unlimited Elements and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create your own custom Elementor widget. So I've been browsing online on CodePen looking for some cool stuff and I just saw a cool button that I want to create into a Elementor widget and we have some HTML and CSS here and I'm going to show you the steps of how to make the, your custom Elementor widget. So the first thing you need to do is download Unlimited Elements. It's free. You can find it in the plugins repository from WP and you install it and activate it like every other pl plugin and inside you can see many many types of add-ons which some of them you can download free some of them you need the pro version but that's not what this tutorial is about. It's about creating your own custom. And to create our own custom add-on or widget, we click add add-on. I'm going to call my magic button. And to edit it, to start editing our widget, we're going to double click and go into the HTML tab. We're going to copy our HTML and same thing we're going to do with the CSS. Looks good. And to save, we're just going to click update. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to test this. So I'm going to add a new page, edit with Elementor, and scroll down drag inside your new element that you just created and as you can see it's working that's pretty cool but no settings yet so now we need to create the settings for this button the settings are actually in the attributes tab so I'm going to create my first attribute which, which will be button text and we're going to allow font editing for this one and to insert it we're going back into the HTML tab we're going to replace the static HTML with the attribute we've just added as you can see on the right side these are the attributes that we've added so I'm going to replace that with button text and I'm going to create a couple more settings the next one is going to be button link the next one is going to be color field choose some kind of default color and the third attribute is going to be for alignment of our button we're going to use a drop down which will have three options. The first option will be center. Second option will be left. And the third option will be right. So these are the settings that I'm going to have right now. Of course, you can make anything into a setting. Let's just insert them inside. So I'm going to replace this href tag with the link. And in the CSS tab, I'm going to replace the center to alignment and the color we need to replace in two places. One is the text color and one is the border color. Of course, we could have done this uh, with two different fields, but right now, just for demonstration purposes, I think that's enough so we're going to click update and we've saved this so now we can test it out I'm going to pages add new edit with Elementor let's scroll down magic button and we've dragged it inside it's showing the effect seems to be working let's check out if it's editable so let's write over here Facebook 
you want that to go to facebook.com you can change the color and we can change the alignment so that was a really really quick tutorial of how to create your custom Elementor widget without PHP, without JavaScript. Everything is pretty simple. Uh, I'm not a developer. I'm a designer that knows basic HTML. So if I can do it, almost anyone can do it. And give me your comments, what you think, what you think needs to be added. It's totally free. Try it out and update me, please, please, please. We're waiting for your feedback. Thank you and see you next time.